Hey, what's up guys? Crafty Fam here with my hat collection part 4 video. From the first three videos, a lot of people seem to like the hats. They gave me good feedback. So today I have enough hats to do a fourth video. So let's get right to it. I'm going to give you the brands, the styles, all that fun stuff. So I'm going to show you my first hat right here. And this is right here a Philadelphia Flyers hat by Michelin S. Snapback, of course. Michelin S calls this series right here the Shark Tooth. Um, I call it more of a shark fin because if anyone had watched Finding Nemo, they saw Bruce's teeth. It didn't look uh, as curved. I mean, his teeth were actually really straight. I mean, I'm not a dentist or anything like that, but uh, just from my personal experience, it looks more straight than it is curved that we see here. So you're going to have a black top rim here, Michelin S sticker right there. Nothing stitched on the side. Of course, on any other Michelin S hat, excuse me, you can have the Michelin S stitching on top of the snap. Um, green bottom brim with the uh, authenticity sticker right there. And I found this hat to be really unique to m for myself anyway because you have a full orange um, dome piece basically um, and then you have this full on black stitching that covers about three fourths of the front of the face uh, if not like half of the face um, kind of deducting from you know this part right here but I found that to be really unique in itself but uh, from that you know it's kind of tough to get a full on black going on right there I mean if I can bring the hat a little closer you're going to see right here on the hat I have a little orange sticking out right there then I mean when you turn it this way because if I want to go this way you're going to get a cover out right there you can see it perfectly right there you're going to see a little orange leakage right there so uh, it, it looks really nice if it was a full on black but like I said it's kind of hard to do that so uh, kudos to Mr. Ness for that really great design um, so the next hat I have for you is not by a huge hat manufacturer it's actually by more known shoe brand or by more of a attire brand but um, by Reebok this one is of course, you can already tell it's going to be a flower hat from the orange, the black. And uh, I like the font on this one. It's more like a straight line kind of thing going on. And this is just me being me, surveying and blowing stuff out of proportion. I mean, just from the S, it's not really curved. I mean, you can kind of see how it looks like a Z. Um, and for myself, I kind of brought me back to the Zenith snapbacks. Um, but like I said, that's just me being me and just observing stuff and blowing stuff out of proportion. So um, I think they're just going for more of the straight line aspect right here on the top of the flyer's name. Then, of course, you have the Flowers logo right there. Top of the orange brim here, you're going to have a NHL Winter Classic 2012 sticker, basically. Uh, Reebok on the side. Then on this side, you're going to have the Winter Classic patch. Then on the bottom, you're going to have a full orange, like right there, I like that. The full orange brim, I like that. Full top, full bottom. Uh, the uh, sticker of authenticity right there. Uh, I do like this hat a lot just because of that brim right there. It's not green like any other snapback out there. It's just a full-on orange. So I like that design. Next hat I'm going to show you is a New Era hat. New York Yankees also nonetheless. And this right here has what's called the snake skin design. I mean, I guess it looks like a snake from a distance, a little closer, I'm not really sure. But um, nonetheless, it is a nice feeling hat. feels really premium in it. And, um, and then, of course, on the side you're going to have the gray New Era stitching right there. The top button is made out of the same material, same snake skin. And on the bottom, um, opposed to having the sticker on the top of the hat, traditionally, you're going to have it on the bottom. And then you have the sticker of authenticity right there, and then I still have the price tag on there also. So let's put that to the side. Next hat. And this hat right here was definitely just spur of the moment, but it's very hard to find this team in South Jersey. So I just bought it spur of the moment, had to have it. New York Giants hat with the uh, top red brim, Michelin S sticker right there. Then inside the font, a really bold red color, New York logo right there. You're going to have the NFL patch on the side, red top button piece, red snapback, and then the red logo on top of the snapback, of course. On the bottom you have a, gr a green brim, price tag still on there of course, then the sticker of authenticity right there. And I really just like this hat because it is the Giants. I mean it's really hard for me to find the Giants hats anywhere in South Jersey so when I saw it kind of had to buy it. Next hat I'm going to show you is also by New Era. It's going to be a Philadelphia Flyers, just the general just Philadelphia on top. And then orange boldness right here you're going to see Flyers. Then on the inside of all that you're going to see a Flyers logo right there. You have an orange top button piece. New arrow stitching on the side right there. No stitching done on the back. You have an orange snap. Bottom here you're going to see green brim, sticker, and then the sticker of authenticity. Next hat. New York Yankees hat. Um, you have like the Times New Roman font right there and a the Yankee gray. Then you have Yankees rays. And then on the inside you're going to have the Yankees logo. Uh, green brim. Then right there you're going to have the New Era logo. New Era logo stitched done right there. Nothing on the back here. Then you're going to have a green bottom brim with a sticker of authenticity right there. Next hat. Uh, another Michelin S hat, which is, uh, I really like it just because of how bold it is. Um, and just by looking at that, you can already tell. 
It says flyers right across and that's a very, very raised, very bold uh, st stitch job, let me say. And I really like it. It feels really good in the hands. I mean, I can run my fingers through that all day. And this is how solid this stitch job is. Then you have the Flyers logo slightly on angle there, right there. You're going to have a top orange brim with the Michelin S sticker right there. On the back, of course, the Michelin S logo on top of the snap. Then on the bottom here, the price tag and then the sticker of authenticity right there. And I just really do like this hat because of the stitching. It's just really bold, really tough. Feels really good in the hands. So right there is all my snapbacks, and then I have three additional hats here, which are all beanies. You're going to have a Winter Classic. This is the one they sold, you know, re again by Reebok. Flyers logo on the front right there, Reebok stitching on the there. Then on the back, you're going to have the NHL logo stitched on there. Uh, and it's, it's really, these hats are actually really comfortable now that I wear them. I love these little poof balls. Just, I don't know why. It reminds me of like a cheerleader. Anyway, <laughs> and then of course you're going to have the colors right here for the... Flyers, black, orange, orange, black, black and orange, black and orange, black and orange. Kind of get my drift. Um, and then you have the black, orange, poof, which is I find kind of cool also. Next hat is another Flyers hat. Um, this one has a fully just black poof, not black and orange, just, you know, black. And I, I like how the stitch job is done with this hat right here in particular because you're going to have a full-on gray. Then on the inside, you're going to have, it says, Philadelphia all the way around. So I thought that's really cool. I really like that. Um, if I can find another Scully like this, that's especially, I really wish Mission Less made uh, Yankee hats, but they don't. So, uh, nothing to cry about. It's just the way the world works. So, I would definitely buy one, though, just because the stitch job is really beautiful. On the front here, you're going to have the Flowers logo. Then on the back, you're going to have a Mission Less logo done right there. And then, of course, I bought the one, this one spur of the moment also, the same time I bought that snapback. But it's a New York Giants Scully, full blue poof with the full on blue top dome piece and then in stitching it says Giants which is I like I, I really like how they do that I want to know how, how do they do that how do they do that I don't know then of course you're gonna have the old school New York Giants patch done on the front right there very vintage very retro then on the back you have in blue you're gonna have a Michelin S logo stitched in I'm actually gonna wear this hat right now so I, I bought these two Giants hats just spur of the moment I saw them had to buy them uh, shout out to the places I bought all these hats bought them in the lids locker room the Athlete's Foot, Kicks USA, all found in the Cherry Hill Mall. So if you live in South Jersey or the Philadelphia area, if you haven't been to the Cherry Hill Mall, check out these stores. They have great deals, especially with uh, Athlete's Foot. I know their deals like the back of my hand, buy one, get one half off. So definitely check that deal out. You can't beat that deal whatsoever. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. That's all my hats. Uh, more hats videos to come if and when I buy more hats. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video, of course. Want to leave any comments, feel free. I'll comment back with all that stuff. Hopefully you're going to enjoy the new channel. 2012 is going to be a great year, in my opinion. So I'm Crafty Fam. You stay you. I'll stay me. Let's stay real. Peace.